good evening, ladies and gentlemen, once again. Um, as a messenger, I was asked to come here and read a very brief speech of his, on behalf of His Excellency. Uh, I had earlier thought it was not so necessary, but I figured as a messenger it was better than I did. Uh, and specifically because it seems at the end of the speech there seems to be a kind of gesture which I figured I should get out. Uh, the President CEO, this is as I read on his behalf. The President CEO, women of love, members of the high table, all protocols duly and respectively observed. I feel highly honored to be here in the historic city of Cork, not only for the purpose of receiving the 2013 Women of Love Award, but to also identify myself and the good people of Kasuna State with the noble cause of empowering the girl child and woman. I am aware that this is the second time this government NGO is holding such an occasion, and I therefore take pride in being part of the history of its self-sacrificing objectives. I am convinced that this organization has a bright future with many goods to come. Distinguished invited guests, I personally consider this occasion important because it is aimed at uplifting the status of women by promoting their rights, protecting their dignity, and by generally assisting them in whatever kind of way to assure that they take their rightful place in societal scheme of things. It is no coincidence that my administration shares similar ambitions with a burning zeal to see girls and women realize their fullest potentials. Already, far-reaching measures are being taken to not only treat women with dignity, but to also lay a foundation for lasting liberation and integration of our women in all spheres of human endeavor. Within our challenges and societal values, the state government has had the privilege to take the lead in many of these efforts. Just to recapitulate some of the measures taken, permit me to state this to state to this August gathering that in my first tenor, specifically in late 2007, and upon realization of the alarming level of poverty among the rural women, my administration introduced an interest-free loan program of over 1.2 million U.S. dollars to women groups and associations. <laughs> this was particularly to serve as an immediate cushioning effect for economic empowerment. For a more permanent solution, and a similar vein, various skill acquisition programs were unveiled to train the women on how to evolve develop and sustain various small-scale business, businesses to enhance wealth creation and reduce the trend of poverty. Through a combination of our determination and linkages, the Southern State was also chosen among the states in Nigeria to benefit from the UNICEF DFID assisted Girl Child Development Program. It is all within this arrangement and focus that the most recently uh, development was that enrollment for girls child in Kazuna has increased by 30%. Wow. Mm -hmm. As we are all aware, the challenges of economic empowerment for women in the development world is very overwhelming. Hence our decision to catch them young. And I do remember the slogan of uh, this association being, when we educate a girl, we educate the future. Uh, for this very reason, we therefore embarked on the construction of girls' child primary schools in each of our 34 local governments. Um, as I earlier said, the program which is being closely monitored and evaluated by the donor agencies is progressing appreci appreciably and latest reports indicate that the girl child enrollment is up by 30%. Uh, the state government has also introduced a mass transit program specifically for girls in order to safeguard them from the hazards associated with the, uh, associated with the patronage of commercial transport. I am happy to also announce that about 50 qualified girls have been sponsored 
this year alone to study various Polish films abroad. Wow. This occasion, uh, this occasion to me is a moment to reflect and to be further spurred to take measures that would uplift the status of women, known fully well, credible organization with widespread monitoring tacticals like the women of love is watching. I thank the organizers most sincerely for appreciating our efforts and I accept this award wholeheartedly.